So final thoughts about the calculator. It's a very solid little calculator. And especially um, because it can do RPN, it doesn't have a lot of the engineering functions that I'm used to as an engineer. Um, but it can do RPN, uh, it can do basic uh, functions, and it's very inexpensive. And if you're into finance, then there's a lot of power within each of these menus, built-in functions um, that make a lot of calculations really easy on the fly. So I think it's really solid. Again, we have the, the finance menu, we have time value of money, interest conversions, cash, cash flows, bond and depreciation, bond calculations. The business menu, we had percentage uh, change, percentage total, uh, markup on cost, a uh, markup percentage on the uh, price. In the summation menu, we could add in all kinds of uh, sums or lists of, of numbers and do calculations on those. So we have the total, mean, median, standard deviation, range, min, max. We could sort it and do forecasts. And in the time menu, we could do various things with setting up reminders and um, appointments adjust our clock. And then the solve menu. You could do basic equations and the, the solver is actually decent. So all in all I think this is a pretty solid calculator. And once again it, it's fairly inexpensive even today uh, to get something that will do RPN. This is one of the cheapest calculators that will do RPN. And, and it's well built. It just depends on whether the uh, the lack of engineering functions is something you can live with.